This is question number 134. Principal says whoever has sexual intercourse with a person who is and whom he knows or has reason to believe to be the wife of another man without the consent or connivance of that man, such sexual intercourse not amounting to the offense of rape is guilty of the offense of adultery. In such case, the wife shall not be punishable as an abattor. So if we apply the principle in the given fact, it is clear that Ravinda will not be liable for adultery because Anil Kumar has not seen him having sexual intercourse with his wife. He has just seen Anil Kumar holding the assets of the wife, not the sexual intercourse. Right. So the sexual intercourse with the married woman without the consent of her husband is the minimum requirement for prosecuting Ranveer for adultery. So the correct answer for this question will be C.